Hello everybody, I am Molly West, and this is Crashlands once again. Now, I need more Glidopus siphons to make water balloons, but I think this episode might be pretty boring if I spend the whole time trying to fight Glidopi again, like I did in the last episode. So I'm not going to spend the whole time doing it. Instead, I'm gonna go investigate these things for them quests that I got. <clears throat> and why does it feel like there is some sort of liquid lodged in my throat? I don't think there is, but it just feels like it. And there's something I've been meaning to bring up in some of my Dark Souls episodes that I keep forgetting. Every time I upload a Dark Souls episode now, I get this thing that says that your video might be shaky, which happened in a couple of my earlier episodes of Dark Souls. That, it like, made the videos kind of all shaky and such, and it, like, asked if, you, if I wanted to stabilize it. However, when I said yes, there... YouTube's stabilization was the problem that made the video look shaky. The camera, I guess, is just frantically moving around all the time trying to keep track of all the enemies in Dark Souls and that, like, made the automated system think that it's shaky. Ah! Here we go, do go! Okay. Anyway, as I was saying, the the automated system thought it was shaky because of the frantic camera movements or something. And so, their solution of making it not shaky is in fact what made it shaky. And there was two of my Dark Souls videos that I put up that looked all shaky because of this thing that was supposed to fix a problem that it thought was there but really wasn't. And I went and undid those, so now those videos are not shaky anymore. That is something that I needed to say, but kept forgetting to say until now. And now it gives me that thing that says that my video might be shaky, even though it really isn't, because it just thinks it is because of the frantic camera angles on any Dark Souls thing that I've been putting up recently. Alright, got that son of a bitch. Safety gogs. Hmm. <laughs> you try to abbreviate the word goggles? I don't like these newfangled abbreviations. Speak English! This is America, damn it! You might not be in America watching this, but this is most definitely recorded in America. And I forgot that I was supposed to be exploring to find. What's this thing? Exploring to find them. Glutterflies mentioned by the professor. <laughs> oh look, we got a tendrum, a tendram over here. Well, let's just ignore that person and get on with the quest. However, I might have to wait till nighttime to do it, and I might have blown it by fighting Glidopi instead of doing what I was supposed to do for that side quest. Oops. Get out of my way. Yeah, yeah, go at me all you want. It ain't gonna make a bit of difference, you flying fuck. Oh. Explore Dulos. I didn't expect to find a couple of young tendrams out here. And this is that glutterfly that Graham, I believe his name was, wanted me to kill. Eh, die already kinda tough. And he's got friends. And I'm very hurt. Damn, he's tough. I probably shouldn't have come here. My mistakes, they will be the death of me. Just you wait and see. Haha. -ha. As long as I don't fuck up on dodging him, I'll be just fine. And we got a little bastard who can't mind its own business. Fucking ass. Take these sun shrooms. I need that sun shroom to stop being on cooldown so I can eat it again, yeah. Pew. You take that. 
And you die. Take it. Choke on it. Inhale it. And die. And I just died. God damn it. Fuck. Well, eat sun shroom so I can get some health back. And now I gotta go get my stuff. It shouldn't be too much far shouldn't be too far from that stuff had. Oh fuck you. That guy attacked me right when I started the according recording, and then I just decided to run away from him because I didn't feel like dealing with it. But he decided to bother me again. Go away, you fuck bucket. What's this thing? It's mine now, a bulby. Mm-hmm. Now, I seem to have taken a wrong turn. God damn it. Nothing that can't be solved with a little bridge work. Yeah. Always nice to be able to do that. It's a nice little feature this game has. And I am heading in the wrong direction. Time to bridge some more gaps, it would seem. And I just unselected what I already had selected. Aren't I stupid? Well then, let me take a this, grab the friggin' thing. You get out of my way, you stupid glider pie. Let me grab my stuff. Yay. As for you, are you still hurt? Fuck no. And those little bastards ain't gonna stop bothering me. I'll need to come back when I have some better equipment. So in the meantime, it's Glidapus smashing time. That ornery ass glutterfly. I will wreck thine ass one day, but not today. Assuming I don't lose interest in this game, which is entirely possible. It's happened before. I've played some games, made some progress, lost interest, and just abandoned them entirely. Hopefully that doesn't happen this time around. Nope. I wish to see all this game has to offer. And that's a tall order. Can I survive that long? Probably not. Yaha. Yes, them Glidopus siphons are mine. Yeah, take that. Haha, -ha. stupid bastard. Stop launching yourself. It's annoying. Die already. Haha, -ha, you found yourself in a bad spot right there. Allowing me to land a series of attacks without taking any damage myself. Choke on it, biatch! Ow, that hurts. I want you to choke on it, not me. You will be the one who's choking around here. What the fuck is that? A glidopus egg? They look kind of weird. God damn it. And die. Die, 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 die. And bam. You are dead. You are dead to me. Do I have what I need to make them water balloons? Just needed some Glidopus siphons for that. You might also notice over here, it looks like I have a curtain put up. But no, not really. I just nailed a bed sheet to the wall. And it works. Poor people solutions. Now, the, about them water balloons. Bam, bam, bam. That might take care of it. Might not. That's three, giving me five. Now I have eight. Any second now, I'll be done. Yeah, now I have 11. I'm gonna need some more. Yeah, I think that's all the water balloons I needed to make that whatever it was called. <coughs> Ugh. Hiccups and coughing. They don't go well together. Yeah, I got the water balloons I need, and I'll have two left over. Now I just need some squee husks. I'll grab this bacon weed real quick. Oh, I think I'm going to burp. Nope, doesn't feel like that burp wants to come out. And before we move on, let's do this. 
No! Put the other one down next to it. And a gnome. Aw, it's got to be placed on floor. Fine, then. I'll put a floor next to my gravestones. And the genome. May you watch over my corpses in peace. <laughs> my dead selves can rest easy knowing that the genome is watching over me. Or is that a bad thing? In past experiences I've had, gnomes generally cannot be trusted. But the genome... Something's different about him. I feel that I can trust him. Now, let's go. Bam! I'm out. Not sure why I crossed my arms over my chest. Just to seem cool, perhaps. No, not the wampet. The squee. No, not the wampet. Fine. Kill it. Kill it, dead. Die, you bitch. Now I get that squee. Squee! Yeah, getting squee husks. That is indeed what I need. And I'm throwing out rhymes all the times. And I'm not even trying to. Perhaps you're being lying to. I didn't use proper grammar, but I needed to make it rhyme. Don't ask questions! I wanted the box, not that thing. Oh, potted bump berry. <laughs> Couldn't hurt to gather these things, though. They all have their uses. Bump berry, glidopus. I shall harvest your organs, sell them on the black market, make a quick buck. Now die. Yeah. Get him. You missed. Haha. -ha. Uh oh. Don't want to be in his attack range. That's bad. See, that's bad, guy. <laughs> Aw, giving me gravel. I don't need your gravel. I need your stone. Your flat stone. Your flat stone is good, and that Glidopus is angry. Glidopus smash! Yes, he wants to smash me, but I am going to let him. I will smash him first. Ow. Assuming I can keep my head on my shoulders long enough to do that. Ah, stop doing that. You're supposed to sit there for a moment after attacking so I get a chance to hit you. Stop with the constant attacks, you bastard. That's cheating. Cheating's bad, I'm good. <laughs> it is so much fun to say that. Thank you, South Park. You got me saying something that I li don't generally say often and can't stop saying, and another thing that wants me dead. Great, I don't want that Wampet Bull. I want this guy. Haha, -ha. time warp. Stupid Wampet, go fuck yourself! I wants me these turtles. Haha. -ha. Ow, I found myself in a bad situation. Is that a jack-o'-lantern? Shit! All right. I made it to safety, I think. And I need a better pickaxe to harvest those weird stones. And this glutterfly wants me dead, apparently. Ma it matters not, as I can slay these bastards rather quickly. And I really need a new weapon. And yes, this is definitely a freaking jack-o'-lantern of some sort. Glutterfly, get over here. <clears throat> Die, bitch. Suck on it. Got some glow juice. Don't really need that in any way that I can think of. And I also got an annoying Glidopus following me around again. That is very annoying. It needs to come to an end. Is there a telepad in the nearby vicinity that I do not know about? That would be great to be able to teleport back to this place. Ow. Because there are these guys that I'm going to need to kill eventually to get some parts to make something that I know I'm going to need. I just don't know what it is that I need to make out of them. 
And then another annoying Glidopus. Go fuck yourself. I'm all out of time for this episode. So thank you all so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed watching it, and I hope to see you again in the next one. Bye!